Welcome to our tutorial on how to set up the Duo Mobile Multi-Factor Authentication, or MFA, application for your UVic account. If you don't have a phone or tablet that supports the Duo Mobile app, there are other options, including alternative authenticator apps like Microsoft Authenticator and a hardware token. Please visit uvic.ca slash MFA to learn about these other options. To get started, you'll need about 20 minutes and a mobile device with an internet connection. iPhones and Android phones are recommended, but you can also use an iPad or Android tablet. There are two ways to sign up. The easiest way is to use a computer for the registration steps so you can scan a QR code from the UVic website using your phone. If you only have your phone or tablet, you can still finish the Duo registration process by using a verification email. Make sure you can open the verification email on your phone or tablet if you're using this method to register in Duo. Most importantly, don't start unless you have time to finish the setup process. Your UVic account can get locked if you stop partway through. Today, we'll be using an iPhone and a computer to sign up. The process is the same for Android devices. Part 1. Install the Duo Mobile app. On your mobile device, navigate to the App Store. If using an Android device, navigate to the Google Play Store. Using the search option, type in Duo Mobile and hit Search. The Duo app should appear near the top of the search list with a green background and Duo spelled out in white blocky letters. Select the app and click Get to install it. If you don't see Duo Mobile in your App Store, your device might not be compatible or your App Store might be region locked. You can still set up your account using another Authenticator app like Microsoft Authenticator or Google Authenticator. We have instructions for setting up alternative Authenticator apps on our website at uvic.ca slash MFA. Part 2. Now that you've got Duo Mobile installed on your phone, switch to your computer or tablet. Click Sign In in the upper right corner of the UVic homepage and enter your Netlink ID and passphrase to log in. You'll be redirected to the Duo sign-up page. It will automatically take you to the next step after 15 seconds, or you can click on Proceed to MFA Sign-up to speed up the process. The Introduction to MFA page has support information, how to contact the computer help desk if you get stuck, and a link to the accessibility accommodation form if Duo Mobile isn't the right solution for you. This page also includes an Enroll Later button that lets you temporarily skip the sign-up process. We recommend enrolling before the deadline to avoid any issues with your UVic account. If you aren't able to enroll by the deadline, contact the Computer Help Desk. When you're ready to sign up, click Start Enrollment. You already installed the Duo Mobile app on your phone during Step 1, so scroll down to the Agreement section at the bottom of the page. Here you can read through the Terms of Service. Tick the boxes to confirm. Before clicking Enable Duo, make sure you have enough time set aside to complete the rest of the sign-up process. Make sure both your devices are charged and are connected to the internet. Don't close the browser window or navigate away before the sign-up process is done. If your sign-up process gets interrupted and your account is locked, contact the computer help desk. Once you click Enable Duo, you'll see a successful confirmation at the top of the page. Now you need to set up your first device. If you do run into any issues with the Duo Mobile app, you can click I'm having issues enrolling a device to back out and try again. When you're ready to proceed, click Duo Mobile app and click Continue. Click Next on the Welcome page to continue. This page gives you information about the MFA service and how it protects your UVic account. Once you've clicked through, select the Duo Mobile option provided. If you are adding a mobile phone, select your country code, enter your phone number, and click Continue. If you're adding a tablet, you can add it without a phone number. On the next screen, double check your phone number is correct and click Yes, it's correct to proceed. 
you'll be prompted to confirm that you've installed the Duo Mobile app. Click Next to show a QR code. Now, switch back to your mobile device if using the QR code. Open the Duo Mobile app. Click Continue and select Use a QR code. If prompted, click Allow to give Duo access to your camera to scan the QR code on screen. You should see the camera open in the Duo app. Bring the QR code into the center of your camera's display and it should automatically scan. If scanning the QR code isn't possible, you can also click Get an activation link instead. This will send a verification email to your UVic account's email address. If you use this option, you must ensure you open the verification email on the same device with the Duo app installed. You should find a verification link in the email. Click on this and it should automatically open the Duo app. Then, in the app, click Next to proceed. The app will automatically name your account University of Victoria. Click Done to proceed. Next, Duo Mobile will give you a few practice prompts to teach you how to approve and deny login requests. The first one is about an unexpected login request. Click Deny. This is how to stop someone from logging into your account if they manage to get your Netlink ID and passphrase. If this ever happens in real life, Duo Mobile will prompt you to report the suspicious login attempt. UVic's information security team will follow up to make sure your account is protected. Click Next to continue. Now you are trying to log into your account and are expecting the Duo Mobile prompt. Click Approve to proceed to complete your account login. The last steps cover app settings like notifications. We strongly recommend you allow push notifications to speed up your login process. It's easier to tap the pop-up notification to open the Duo Mobile app than having to do it manually. And finally, you can choose whether you want to share data with Duo Mobile to improve the app's reliability. This option can be turned off without affecting your access to the app. In this case, I'll turn off data sharing, then click OK. Now you should see your UVic account card displayed in the app, which means you've successfully added your UVic account to the Duo Mobile app. Back on your computer, you should now see a prompt that you've successfully added Duo Mobile to your account. Click Continue to proceed and then click Login with Duo. It will now send a push to your device to approve your login. On your phone, you should now see a Duo pop-up notification asking you to confirm your login. Tap on the notification to automatically open the app and click Approve. On your computer, click Yes, this is my device if you are on a personal device to save your Duo authentication for seven days. Now you should see the Enrollment Complete page. We encourage you to set up more than one device with Duo to avoid getting locked out of your account. You can also create bypass codes, which are one-time use codes you can use to log in in case your phone stops working or you don't have it with you. You can find more information on how to make bypass codes on the UVic MFA support page. If you have any questions or run into any issues with signing up or using the MFA service, please contact the Computer Help Desk.